welcome to my video so we're just gonna jump right into it so i am going to take my mascara brush spoolie whatever you want to call it and i'm just going to brush my natural brow hairs upwards Now I'm going to be taking some eyelash glue. I usually use the Kiss Clear glue, but I am using this one. I got it from my local beauty supply store. And so now I'm just going to be putting that eyelash glue all over my brows. This is what's going to give that feather effect for your natural brows. Then I'm going to start by brushing the hairs downward. That way the product can just get all the way in it. And then I'm going to brush them back upwards. You want to take your time with this step because this is going to be the frame of your brows. This is what ultimately your brows will look like. We're just going to darken them up a bit. So yes, take your time. Get those hairs, you know, very laid, okay? <laughs> Now I'm just going to be taking the back of some tweezers that I have and I'm just flattening out those brows. You can literally take anything and just even your finger and just flatten out your brows. Now to fill them in, I'm taking my Anastasia brow uh, dip pomade. Usually I would use a pencil for the feather brows, but I ran out of pencil. So I was using this and I'm like, okay, it's, it works. So that is what I'm doing. I'm just doing a little light strokes or a little light hair strokes to fill in the gaps. So again, you just want to do light upward strokes. That way you can mimic actual eyebrow hairs. Once I have those brows filled in, now I'm going to take my mascara wand or spoolie and I'm just going to brush up the excess product. Um, that way it won't be so dark or so bushy. Now to conceal the brows, I'm taking my Maybelline foundation um, and I'm just going to be carving out my brows. So the only time I really do soap brows is when I am not wearing a full face of makeup um, and I just want my brows to be a little bit more enhanced or if my brows aren't done and I just need them to look like something, this is when I do the soap brows. So this is why I use my foundation because I don't want too much of a light appearance underneath my brows. Um, and it definitely just gives a natural effect. So this is definitely a everyday go-to brow look that I absolutely love. Now you'll see me blending out the excess foundation with a blending brush. You guys, this is just the most naturalist looking brow. Now I'm just going to do those same steps to the other side as in applying the foundation underneath to carve out the brow and just blending it out. And that is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe. If you have any questions, make sure you leave them down below. And yes, ladies, thank you so much. And I will see you in the next video.